right now, miss, to tell you the truth, my mother right now is just the best help I can try to think about. Any little thing for help, you understand? But not ask somebody for silver, diamond, or pearl, but whatever them can do for assist her by getting some food supplies and things. January, last year, 's getting some weird dreams about like some dog running me down I get up on a call and I said to her, I said mommy may I get some dreams I mean I really like to dream them mm. and we said to her I said mommy more I left from St. Mary because me not really like what happened mm. me never know where in St. Mary she lived where she was working because oh, I never visited her to tell you the truth I don't really know but I was in Crecton at the time and it was my other sister Go down there. I never visited here before. She came up the January and I said to her, Monsieur, she called me and said to read me to her at home. When I saw her the January, I said to her, I said, Mommy, you know, I see your foot look natural, but it look like it get a blow. It never really start to show it because it look natural like this. But I feel it say something not right with her foot. She said, Oh, you know, I said, I don't know, but I saw me feel as if it's something wrong with the foot. Anyways, I'm, I was working at children. I'm a porter. I think it's my grandmother called me and said to me, I'm for come look for her face. Miss, to be honest from my heart, when I come and I see her foot, I run my wife around. The foot is like the guns where you have on, but the foot rotten out, mash out from the inside, I suck out. You understand? And she have the foot, them go to church, them go do everything, try to get the foot in her thing. I said to her, I said, Mommy, the foot is either going to lose your life or you have to take off it because I'm not feel it. Miss, I tell you the truth, I feel back everything for you. I could concentrate on work, I could focus my sick, especially when I was a night shift. No matter how I left here good, I reach work, I just sick, I can't work in peace because everything I reach here, I feel it back because I had the first birthday. Understand? So everything reflects back on me. So when I, it was the Thirteenth of February, my car down at the hospital, which was a Monday. The foot here so burst at the vein down at the ankle. When I smell the foot, I said, Mommy, that foot the half go. She said, No, I said, Mommy, either you are going to go or the foot go. When she go down at the hospital, the same thing when I tell her, the same thing the doctor then tell her. Miss had the fourteenth of February, one year now. She did the first amputation on this foot. And when she do the foot, Miss, me, nobody never had to tell me so she didn't even know because yes, when I get up off of the chair, when I go up and lie down and sleep. I saw me go down them say what happened to them? I said, mother lose her them say, oh you know me say yes because I feel it. He says I start to wipe red stretch so I she called me and start crying. I say, yeah man, I know. I miss from there so she go back she come out, she go back in, she lose a bit too because them said they, they never had run the test for her to find out if the blood sugar alright or she won't do that anything. You understand? Them cut off the first big toe. The name Dr. Williams work at KPH. When I see it, I said to her, I said, Mummy. To the way of them two of this year, you have to lose them because them have to go. And when you cut out the rest of two of them, I said to her, I said, Mommy, I know it's difficult for you, but I try to do it. Miss, from she lose the foot, them, daughter, them, not there. You understand? She lose her two sons, them before that. And not even funeral, none of them, she, the next one, will come. And from she lose this, them foot here, Miss, she was here at a time till her mother travel overseas and I was the one at the hospital every day my dear KPH to and from a wash me do so everything. Her other leg is diabetes cause her to lose the toes? Yeah, because the blood All never right. does well, on a moment. The diabetes the diabetes so she have the blood never does circulate properly. So it's like they never know so she want blood in the system. So it's like the foot now. And she never get enough blood so it helps mash up the foot. First of all Losing the foot. I mean look back and see. When I have my two foot, me ups and down. Me do everything. Me do everything. Move up and down. Me no know what me no do. Me no know what me no do. Seriously, me no know what me no do. Do me do more than we can think of. And seriously. From me lose my foot, my two daughter then. It's not they no member say me exist. Seriously, they no member say me exist. Only me, my two son. 
my two son then gone. I still have my cry more time. My just say, Father God, then, then two sons are gone in the boat. It is the two sons, then, then try them best. Then cook. Or sometimes they come and they, they, they know, cook. But being as the un, handicapped now, I can't really do. What is wrong with their hands? I miss it. So from she do all of them surgery at home and mm -hmm. she do home not moving up and down. Some sickness a reach or she a ball for pain and all them things. I feel it like at a bush she boil for certain things. I understand because to tell you the truth, miss. The next two that of them, miss. Money, food, everything. I just me. You understand? Mm -hmm. I lost my job because of this situation. It's called the only madam I have. But the day's work, yes, you know, miss. But it can't help me to do what I want to help. You understand? Because I have to buy pampas and food and then the mood like to see my mother go. Oh, she's not supposed to go. I don't know if anyone knows what it feels like to have a mother and don't have a mother. Yes, sometimes we have a little difference, but this is my mother, miss. There was a point, I'm not going to tell you that I don't feel to give up. But when I remember back, say, if I give up on her, it's like, I remember, say, she, as she bring me for nine months. Say, I forgive up on her, who is going to be there? You understand? Because me are the only one there as the girl now. The next two no care, none at all. You understand? And you lost the two brothers. And I lost my two brothers then. I said it set me back. Because my ear must to cook. My, I was saving to buy a deep fryer to cook. And from she take down, everything just gone. Savings, everything I have to spend on. Sometimes I don't have the food. Sometimes I don't have the money. Other people. This I see. I love you, brown. Otherwise known as mommy. If you hear your name, sis, me thank you for everything, miss. I see me thank you for everything. They are the one most of the time, miss. When mm -hmm. call me and say, come here. Or sometimes she get to work, she call me and say, sis, me get to work. Come do this. And me get other little works. And me try to put the two and two together for she can get. Right now, miss, to tell you the truth, my mother right now, it's just the best help I can try to think about. Any little thing for help. You understand? I not ask somebody for silver, diamond, or pearl, but whatever them can do for assist her by getting some food supplies and things. Because she's here with her mom, yes, but she have my daughter just the first thing, my grandmother. She, my daughter live here with her. She's the one who's taking care of her because her father not doing anything from birth to now. So she have her from primary school till she reach high school. Sometimes, yes, it's struggling because the money I take and give my daughter, I have to use it for a she. And I feel that way most of the time, no one says I can't give my daughter certain things, which is that I'm not that type of mother. You understand? I want her to get where me never get. But with she now, don't have the money sometimes, I feel that way. I don't like nobody feel like they can't serve for me or feel like them. I just want the little help. I even can't even raise some chicken. Where she can get to push back something, you understand? Because our mother have the fall cook down there, so. Say, so, you no, know, forget some chicken for help, benefit even my daughter and she. I appreciate it, but me, I not have the money for the certain things, you understand? Because as I get the little work, I have to think about oh, shit. Sometimes I'm frustrated and want to know the phone, but I cannot do it, miss, because my mind can't suck it because I'm not the only mother I have. If I lose her, I don't have nothing else. I don't know how them feel for know their mother is here and them not attend to her. I don't know what it feels like to them knowing them have a mother and you're not paying the mind. Some people don't have a mother because they're not born. No. They're born, but either the mother dead or they don't know the mother. How it feels you have a mother, she never bring, she bring you for nine months. She never abandon you. She never put you up for adoption, nothing at all. So why abandon her now? I could do the best while we can because when you're a person that you cannot put roses on a live body for them rejoice. A body cannot take roses because they don't know what to do. So you can wait till your mother dead before you can do something for her. You understand? We now get no younger, we are get older as the day go by. You have a mother, I know you must know what it feels like to have a mother into this position. You understand? And this is what set her back because she's a very hard working woman. Anyway, the little work there, she got there. So, this position now, I understand it's set back. It's set back me too because if I have $10 for give my daughter 5 and 4 lamp and 5, I cannot do it. I have to give my daughter less. Mm -hmm. You understand? Yes, see. Mm -hmm. If I even get a foot, if 
let me go get that food. At least, you know, we can. You understand? Up on it, and you understand me? But just to stay one place. This isn't you. This. This not me. This not me. Me used to walk up myself and go run and sometimes me call that one here and cuss that one here and you know just just a sort of something just to laugh. You understand me? I'm from me lose my foot. It's like me been down to me down to the number me rushy can't be funny. Rushy can't be funny. Rushy can't be funny. I mean, I do not do she can no not if I know that in my use of the foot and I find if you want me to know. Just wait for me, just wait for me. She can't if I know that in nothing. Just wait for me. I me not do that nothing. Me not do that nothing. And the man, me not know what the man said. Me not do that. The man said, me not know what me do. Me not know what me do. Me not know what me do. Me tell you, me choke. Me not know what me do. Me not know what. We manage with medical bills and so forth. Tell you the truth, right now, she have prescription for go feel, for get this trip for, for um, test my sugar. Sometimes, sometimes I get them and sometimes I don't get them. Yes. You're, under the, you're on the NHF program? Yes. Yeah, me on a, yeah. I have to use the NHF sometimes, sometimes they don't take it, sometimes they don't take it. Sometimes when they get the medication, most time, and all the while they have it, sometimes I have to go back more than one time, sometimes I walk more. Save the bus here. Miss, I love my mother with all of my heart and my mind to tell her the truth and just the help from anyone to assist her with any little way. I'll be very much appreciative. She have a blood test to go to the 27th of this month. You understand? And mm -hmm. that is another money again, miss. We find the transportation fair for go to and from mm -hmm. because to she out that side, uh, six grand them a charge her. Sometimes I don't really have it, but I push. I don't call no one and beg no one, nothing. I fight my way through. Mm -hmm. If I have five dollars, I squeeze the five dollars. I eat less just for sale. I was bigger than this, and from she lose all of this, me just come down right back like this, because oh. everything we must save for though, just gone. I am not perfect, no one is not perfect, but because of my mom right here, I'm just asking for the help. I'm just asking any little thing that we can do to assist. What can persons contact you? My contact number is 876 201658 Contact my grandmother at 876 536 8731. That's Valerita R. Please.